What's up guys, Grim here. Uh, it's my birthday today. I'm going to go out and have a good time, hopefully. So I want to give you guys kind of an update that no video will be coming out today, but uh, except for this one, of course. Um, and uh, basically I just got up not too long ago, got me a shower, eyes are probably bloodshot from the shower, but um, uh, yeah, we're going to go out and go at a really nice Japanese steakhouse near here and have us some very good food, maybe have a beer, um, also go to a casino afterwards, you know, all the bad stuff, you know, the, the gambling and uh, drinking a little bit and stuff like that. Um, usually I'm a, I'm a very mild drinker as in I never drink uh, at home or anything like that unless I'm barbecuing. But uh, I'm a social drinker. I'll go out and uh, go eat some Buffalo Wild Wings and have a beer there with my friends and stuff like that. But usually I don't, I don't get drunk or anything like that. I just like to have a beer here and there. Um, but whenever I go to the winery, we got a local winery here that it's called the River Ridge Winery. It's just off of the Mississippi River. And this place is amazing. It's got... It, they specialize in dry red wines and also uh, panini sandwiches. They're just, man, so good. It's my favorite place to go to, and we're going to go there tomorrow. So uh, I do quite a bit of drinking whenever I go there because they give you a whole bottle at a time, and we really make an even, evening of it, basically. And uh, it's my favorite place to go to, so whenever we go there, we kind of go over the top, but usually I'm very mild and... Uh, partying and stuff like that i like to I, i'm a gamer i like to go home uh load up some rift or something like that and go kick some butt in some war fronts and uh drink a mountain dew or something like that you know that's normal normal gamer stuff there but um yeah we're gonna go out and do all the festivities tonight and then go do some more stuff tomorrow uh, hopefully it'll be a good time. Hopefully uh, I'll be able to work on the Saturday video uh, on Saturday. Well, it'll be the weekend video. I've, I've changed it from being the Saturday video into the weekend video because I'm not always, I don't always get it done on Saturday. So, and lately it's been Tuesday before it comes out. So, man, I'm really slack. Uh, it's just a lot of, a lot of things going on, you know, being busy, all that good stuff. And, uh... Yeah, hopefully we'll get all that out to you. I'm actively working on another try-on video, uh, which should should be pretty good. Um, I reached out to one of my friends and basically said, man, uh, me recording all this stuff, I stutter a lot when I talk. If you guys haven't noticed whenever I do these long talking videos, I do a lot of stuttering. And I say stuff like, you know, and just all the things that you don't want to say normally whenever you're talking for long periods of time. And, well, that means that the, I got to re-record things quite often. So whenever you see a, take for instance, a creating your perfect character or uh, any of the other trying videos that I made, um, they're really long usually and it's a lot of dialogue where I'm talking a lot and I stutter a lot so I've got to cut it up quite often I, I say something I cut it right there and then I'll say the next line and I'll say it several times because I'm gonna stutter several times it, it's just gonna happen that, that's I'm not too good at the speaking part uh, as in being really clear and not messing up so yeah it takes a lot of work for me to do the speaking part the gameplay part and then, and then afterwards I got edited all up as in the, the video files that I said something, you know, eight times before I got it right. Well, you got to find out where that is and cut it off right there. So you only get the part that sounded good. Well, that takes a long time, a long time. So whenever I do a try on video, I'm, it's, it's usually days of work and, uh, uh, I hope you guys enjoy it because I put so much work into it, man. And, um, but basically I reached out to a friend of mine and I said, Hey man, can you help me with the editing? And he said, yeah, sure. Well, I'll help you out. Um, so hopefully we'll be able to produce the videos faster. Uh, I'll be able to focus more on the Warfront videos and then get my Trime videos out as well. Um, 
because you know it's kind of depressing whenever you go to the editing part as in you did all this recording and you're very passionate about what you're doing and you love your work but then it's like oh my gosh i'm about to spend four hours editing these videos uh, or this you know just one video a 30 minute try on video will man hours upon hours for me because i stutter so much uh, and then whenever i go to edit it i gotta cut it all out to where I get the perfect take and all that good stuff. So I'm really proud of the work after I get it done. I'm really happy with it. Whenever I watch the video afterwards, I'm thinking, good job, Grim, good job, man. But it takes a lot of effort. So I hope you guys are enjoying it and hopefully they'll get even better as we go along because with my friend helping with the editing, they might get a little bit different because I do the same thing on all of my videos. It's the same intros, the same outros, uh you know same music for the most part all that stuff and uh he'll probably change around a little bit of it uh to make it maybe uh more appealing a little bit touch of uh maybe his own flair or something like that and hopefully it works out with uh with him doing the editing uh i'm sure i'll like his work but uh you never know he, he might go ah, actually i don't want to do this and I might have to reach out to one of you guys to help with that. Uh, kind of like how people like Swifty and all that. They all have a friend that does the editing for them, which makes it a lot easier. It's a lot easier to make the content whenever you're, you're splitting up the work. Because, I mean, uh, I'm a big comic book reader. I read a lot of comic books. And uh, with the comic book process, you think, okay, somebody draws the pictures, somebody writes the story. No, it's not even that simple. Okay, so you got somebody that draws the pictures, but he just does the sketching. Then you got somebody that does the inking, and then you got somebody that does the coloring. And they separate the job to lots of different people that are really good at their particular areas. So if I'm really good at entertaining you guys, which you guys seem to have liked, uh, liked it so far, then probably I need to stick to that and then put the editing in somebody else's hands and uh it's just a point am i at that point to where i can i can allow somebody to do that you know where they'll be happy with the work if you're somebody that is just starting out most likely you're not going to be able to get anybody to help you with editing because you're not big enough you can't offer them enough or whatever else so yeah hopefully it all works out i hope you guys are going to enjoy the content coming up but um i'm about to get off here and uh so far, nobody's gotten me a gift, but I think I'm about to get a gift. I, th I, th I think somebody's getting me something for Wizard 101, though. <laughs> I've been playing that game so much because uh, all my friends and family are on it. So it's so easy for me to just jump on the laptop and play it some, blah, blah, blah. Whereas Rift won't run on my laptop. So I can't hang out in the living room with everybody and play Rift. So my login time to Rift has been really lacking lately, which uh, I'm... I'm chomping at the bit to do some PvP and stuff. I'm just like, man, I want to play some Rift. But all my friends are on here and they're wondering if I'm getting on and all this stuff. So I jump on Wizard 101 and have a blast because all these people I know are on it. So uh, I think they're going to get me uh, uh, a pack. You can actually go to like Walmart or Target or even GameStop and they sell like the little game cards. You know how, uh, let's see here. I hope this ain't too loud on the the mic the drawer right behind my microphone so like take for instance this uh, steam cart you know they got stuff like this at uh, walmart and all that that i don't know if they have steam i don't know but um i got this card because i ended up buying a uh, a really good deal that they were offering at one time to where you got this game or something no 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 it was uh you bought a razor item and I got a brand new uh, headset just in case my headset ever goes out. I got another one. And I also got a new uh, keypad. Uh, if you guys can see it, oh, my, my cord isn't stretching. But I use a keypad to uh, game with. It's a lot easier than the keyboard and all that stuff. So yeah, I play with a keypad. So I ended up getting a new keypad and a new, uh, new headset. And it was like super cheap. 
and if you bought it for the really reduced price you also got a $50 steam card so yeah that's how I got that I was thinking about giving away in one of the uh, videos because I never use steam money um, but uh, these cards here if you go to Walmart they'll usually have like wizard 101 uh, cards that they're not quite cash in the game uh, like World Warcraft will have monthly subscriptions that you can get with the cards and Steam has their money and all that stuff but with Wizard 101 it has like bundles that you buy as in you go up there and you get one of these cards and you go huh well it has a house on here almost like a rift dimension if you could get go up there to Walmart and grab one of these cards and it'll have like this exclusive dimension that whenever you uh, Take for instance, if you it, it's a blacksmithing dimension that you go in and you bought it from Walmart or whatever on this gift card, so you've already paid money for it. And if you go into this dimension and you do your crafting in there, it will like have a lot better chance of getting a skill point or you know whatever. And uh, take for instance, one of them for Wizard 101 is. Uh, uh, botanical garden place that you go in and you do gardening in there and it makes your plants grow up twice as fast and if you harvest the plants you get a lot of rewards and stuff so yeah pretty cool and then it'll throw in a new mount it'll be something related to the gardens or whatever it might be like I don't know a big gopher or something you know whatever and uh, then you'll have a pet that goes with it then you'll have all this other stuff and it's all included on this bundle and it'll have like a whole armor set that looks like gardening materials and you'll have you know a rake or whatever that you're using as a weapon and you can transmog it all to look like that well it'll have a lot of different things on these cards and I'm thinking somebody's gonna buy me one of them I, I'm getting the hint that that's gonna happen so that would be pretty cool I, that'll be a gift on my birthday which would be pretty cool everybody usually always takes me out to eat because there's such nice places to eat around here there's the river ridge winery there's the japanese steakhouse and all that good stuff so all right i'm kind of doing a lot of rambling all right so uh i'm gonna go ahead and wrap this up and just tell you guys thank you for sticking around and uh we're on pretty much uh we just i think we're right at finishing two years on youtube now so uh we're starting on the third year we're at quite a bit subscribers so hopefully it'll continue to grow and uh my other channel i'm going to be doing other gaming on there hopefully i keep saying that but uh whenever it comes down to it i never end up putting gameplay footage on there because you know i'm not putting out enough rift content as in so last thing i'm going to do is put gaming content on the other channel whenever the rift content is lacking but I'm going to get my scheduling down eventually. And for those of you waiting on the drag video, the only reason why it isn't out just yet is because I'm trying to get my friends to all do it with me and they're all working. They're all telling, every time I call them, I, I'm working today, I'm, I'm trying to sleep, uh, whatever. You know, none of them are wanting to come over and do it right now because they're all busy. So hopefully we'll get them over here and get that video done and set a new goal and all that stuff like I promised two weeks ago, you know. I, it frustrates me that we haven't gotten that done, but hopefully I'll get people in on it and all that good stuff. As you can tell, I got a haircut. Yep, looks good. But that makes it to where my hat doesn't fit. Look, look, it's like spacing on the side. It's so big. I'm going to have to switch to one of the other hats. And... Alright, that's, that's a lot better fit, but it doesn't match the shirt. Alright, so I got another hat that will match the shirt. And it fits. So, all right, guys, take care. And I hope everybody has a really good day. And I'm really looking forward to mine. So, all right, take care, guys. My name is Graham, and I'll see you next time.